Hey guys, real quick, want to push out something that we're going to try to go to uh, January 1st, 2018. We're going to change up how we log our training a little bit. Uh, we're going to start using Target Solutions to log our training. Uh, we've been reviewing this and it's not set up 100% uh, all the features and functions, but we believe that we'll be able to get better information out and it'll be easier for you guys to uh, log training on a daily basis. So. Um, I've got Gage Bumbelow's page pulled up here, and uh, what we're looking at is what you'll see when you log in in your home page. Just a few little things that uh, you'll take notice of. To start with, you'll see that we have a credential up here. It's your EMT or paramedic credential. When this is fully functional, you'll be able to click on this, and everyone's is set up like this for now, but some of your hours may not be imported. And so you'll be able to see that as active status, your credential number, how many hours you have currently, and you'll see the breakdown of the hours that you need. And then down here in this section, you'll see where in-person training is where I have uploaded um, Jeff Roberts' courses. Uh, but these other courses are, you can hit this down arrow, and that will take you to classes that you can take to get CEUs that will go toward this credential and each section is like that okay we'll return to home you will go over here if on a daily basis if you and when you want to log your daily training you'll go to here daily training um, officers you'll you'll look here and you'll pick what kind of training that you did from the selected list um, I think we counted there's 90 different um, preset courses that are, are available and so today we did fire behavior let's say once you open that up um, we'll just put myself in there for now you can put anybody on your crew this is broken down by objectives in the NFPA standard and so we might have went over fire control theory uh, we might not have been development in a compartment but we might have done science of fire okay we're going to fill out the date we completed, what time we finished, how many hours. If it's got a red asterisk, it's required. Okay, there's some down here, such as units involved, that does not have an asterisk. If you would like to put that, you can. It's not necessary. The instructor on this one is not required. And any additional information that you would like to put. So we would finish filling this out we'll say it's today I finished at 10 I spent an hour fire training company or individual CFD uh, work did it at station one okay then I'll record as complete and that is done and saved okay so now you can go back to home and if you wanted to see that class, you could go to My Credentials, and it would show up in this Training Tracker Firefighter um, down here under Company Training. Okay, and it's probably going to be down here at the bottom. Okay, so you'll see where we have been training. Nope. This is on gauges, not mine. So, anyway, that's where you can see which classes that you have taken. If you just want to start from home, one thing that we've learned um, recently is that ISO will give you credit on a daily basis for checking your SCBA. So, you can go to this icon here. You can click that. I'm going to take me off and add Bumbelow. Continue. And it's going to take you to the daily SCBA checkout. Okay, they're going to give you a predetermined quarter of an hour for checking that. Another thing they're going to do is if you check the truck off, they're going to give you credit. So we would select that icon. They're going to give you a predefined half an hour of training credit for checking the truck off. So that's set up there. One more place that they're going to give you some credit is for fitness. Okay, so here we can click that icon. 
select who was participating, continue. They're going to give you 0.33 of an hour on a daily basis for doing that. So anyway, just a few things that we wanted to go over with uh, before the first of the year gets here. Um, take some time, look through here. Um, you can self-assign. You can find different courses that maybe you want to take on your own. Um, and it will all count in your training uh, history and we'll be able to get nicer, cleaner, better reports using Target Solutions. So uh, as we move forward, we'll have some more features that are plugged in in this section here. And uh, we look forward to building this out and trying to get the most out of it for everybody. All right, guys. Have a good day.